In this video, we're going to talk about the scale tool inside of SketchUp. So there's a tool that allows you to scale things as big or small as you'd like, and it's a really easy tool, and I'll show you how to use it. So all you have to do is select the object that you want to scale. So I'll select this guy here just by clicking on him. If we were to select multiple objects at once, we could just click and drag like this and select. So we'll just scale this guy. So I'll click away and then click on him. So to scale something, all you have to do is select the scale tool in your toolbar, which is the two squares with an arrow right here. And you'll find it over here in this toolbar on the left if you're in the free version, but I'm in the pro version, so it's at the top. But the easiest way to get to it is just hit S on your keyboard. So with your object selected, hit S, and it will bring up the scale parameters here. And all you have to do is click and drag on the corner if you want to scale it proportionately, meaning the width and height stay the same. So if you just drag the side, you can make it uh, skinnier or wider. And if you drag from top to bottom, you can make something shorter or taller. So what's really cool is if you start dragging it, you can just type in, notice down here in the corner it says 1.23. And before we moved anything, it was at 1.0. So if I type in three, it will make this three times as big. So if I type in 100, it will make it 100 times as big. So that's the scale tool in SketchUp. I just actually found out about this pretty recently. I did not even know there was a scale tool, even though it was in my toolbar the whole time. So I thought I'd make a video just to show you guys. Um, thank you for watching. Please let me know in the comments if there's anything you'd like to see or talk about inside of SketchUp. I'll see you in the next video.